Hey everybody, my name is Alex and in this video we are going to install Go and GRP curl on Ubuntu. So I have a Substack article that goes along with this. I will link it in the description and we are basically just going to follow this guide. So the first thing we need to do is get the download link for Go. We want to make sure we're using the latest version here so we can just click the link in the article here and we are on Linux so I'm going to right click and you can't see the context menu but I'm just right clicking and then clicking copy link and then we're just doing wget and then whatever the download link is so let me jump over to Delta here wget and then just paste that in and we're going to download that file jumping back to the instructions we are going to extract that file that we just downloaded should take only a second then this actually removes any previous installation it's not necessarily needed if you know that you've never installed go before but it doesn't hurt to just run it no matter what even if you don't have a previous version And then what we're going to do is change the ownership of the extracted file. So if I do ls, there's actually a go folder right there. And I want to change the ownership of that go file because we're going to move it to a root directory. So we're going to just simply do that. And this is where we move it into that root directory and it says renamed but this is basically the Linux version of moving something and now we need to update some environmental variables that way when we actually run go uh, commands it knows where to find it so we're gonna sudo nano etsy profile and I actually already have this because I had a previous installation but if we go into our directions here you're basically just copying what's here and then you're pasting it at the bottom all this other stuff was uh, already existed at the top here and we're just pasting it at the bottom here and then do control X Y enter to save the changes and you can either at this point log out of your terminal and log back in to have your changes take effect or you can simply just run source slash Etsy profile and that is going to basically trigger those updates and we can do go I believe it's dash version or just go version there we go and you should see this go version listed here if you have everything installed correctly now the next thing we want to do is actually install grp curl because that is really the whole reason why I wanted to install go and it's just one single command luckily you just copy this go install command now that we can run go commands and this does take a moment here it'll get like the latest version and then it'll go ahead and install it and just like with go we can there's not like a grp curl version that you can run but if you run grp curl dash help you should see the help commands um, come up with like all the different things that you can do for uh, grp curl so let's jump back and this can take a moment depending on your connection and the speed of your PC this is a really slow mini PC so it I honestly think the bottleneck is probably the processor and not the internet uh, internet speed so I'm gonna give it a second here and we should have it all installed Alright, everything is installed, 
and if we just run this grp curl dash help we can see that the help command has shown all the different flags and if I just go grab like a random grp curl command like let's get the status of a space mesh node I just need to update the IP address here to the actual one we can see we're actually able to query and get the results. So that's it. Hopefully you have everything installed. If you have any questions, feel free to post the comments and I will see if I can help you out. I will see you in the next video.